One of the exciting things that we're doing here is not just building a robot for drywall finishing, but really building a heavy machinery platform for the interiors of construction spaces. At the core of the Canvas system, we use the Universal UR10. This is a huge enabler for us because it's one of the lightest robots for the strength that it has. And what we're doing is making agile automation that can go anywhere at any time. So we need a very lightweight robot to be able to transport it on a mobile platform. At the same time, we have to finish up to 15 feet. So putting a lot of weight into the air can be very dangerous from a tipping standpoint. The product maturity of the UR systems are pretty much unmatched for collaborative robots uh, right now. And what this has allowed us to do is ramp up very quickly. The second aspect is that it has very good force control. The material we're using is very soft. You can actually scratch it with your fingernail. So we need a very precise force control to just remove the amount of material we want, no more, no less. The force control software inside the UR is actually completely free. You can uh, use it, it's extremely precise. When we say we apply 10 Newton, we measure it because we trust but verify here at Canvas. It's actually 10 Newton. It's very, very consistent. We looked at several other robot arms. For cost reason, we were very disappointed by the maturity of the level of force control they have. Because construction is such a dynamic environment, we need a safe machine that can work alongside other workers. We not only have our workers, working alongside their co-workers in construction, but we have other trades working around us as well. And so having a machine and an arm that's collaborative and that can be safe around workers is important. The platform of the SDK from Universal Robot is definitely on the more open side. We have as a developer access to all the low-level information current sensor, temperature sensor of every joint, everything on this UR system. That means that you can choose to control the UR in a very low level way. You can rebuild your inverse kinematics and control at the joint level space, or you can rely on the advanced functions that UR provide for free uh, with the robot to go faster and do what you want to do. We got the first UR robot and we were on site only two months after that doing our first job. We sometimes find issue with some of the behavior we're not expecting, and the support is really great. When we submit cases and logs, we get a great response. They ask for more information, and they're really very good at suggesting fixes or solutions. We find all our cases with my UR, and that's, that's the one place where we can track all our arms, everything that happened when the warranty expires, all those good information. The software and the support that we get from them has been incredible and has allowed us to move very fast because of how mature it is. And then we've worked with them as we've started to deploy machines across the country. So we now have a nationwide footprint. It's been exciting to work with UR almost since the beginning of the company. Mm -hmm.